episode of Pokemon Sword. Okay, so I filled up a camera. And I got a potion. It auto saves. I think I'll turn it off just in case something messes up. Oh. I know. Auto save. Uh, yeah, just in case something messes up and I have to restart. Yeah, I got a potion. Listen, Prison Star, I've been thinking. You're a Pokemon trainer now. You must want to try your hand at the gym challenge, right? The gym challenge, mate. The annual competition where trainers can battle it out. For the right to challenge the champion. But the trick is, you've got to be endorsed if you want to take part. And me doesn't seem to think I'm up to that stuff. So I'm thinking I ought to talk to, to the professor and see if she can help. You've got to take part too. I got a rival. It's just the same thing. Just the thing every trainer needs to keep growing stronger after all. Keeps you motivated, right? The professor's house is way down at the end of Route 2, so let's head there and give, it, give our team the chance to train up a bit along the way. Yeah, the other one was pretty long, but the third two. Over here. Alright, Prison Star, it's time to fill our team a bit, teams a bit, and I'm here to teach you how, you'll need to guess Pokemon if you've got any hope of filling that Pokedex. Lee, where did you come from? Only look at, look at you, little Prison Star, you've already caught some on your own. My mom gave you those Pokeballs, did she? I'll give you some more Pokeballs in return. I'll only ask that you catch plenty of Pokemon. The Pokemon around here seem easy to catch. It's almost like they're itching to join some trainer's team, wouldn't you say? Ah, two new Pokeballs! Thank you, Lee. I wasn't only expecting you to give me like 10. The Pokemon on your team will get EXP points when you catch Pokemon too. And of course, they get EXP points from battle, so take on the other trainers along the path to help your Pokemon thrive. Your team will keep changing and keep on changing and growing as you get stronger together, no doubt. But even, I don't know exactly how yet, show your champions into good, alright? catch loads of Pokemon. The professor will be shocked when she sees. Oh, do I have you? What the fuck? I missed it. I missed it. Do I have you? No, I do not have you. Um, use a water gun. Oh no, my defense. That didn't do much as I expected. Not as much as I expected. I don't kill it. Bravo, don't kill it. And now another tail whip. Lowering me down. 
I only had three. Run! Give him the ball. Yes! I caught the Nicket. I even got the perfect name for it. Two. Nicket's data will be added to the Pokedex. Aided by the soft pads on its feet, it silently raids the food sources of other Pokemon. Survives off its ill-gotten grains. Yes, I've got a perfect name for it. Foxy has been added to your party. Okay, uh, the squirrel. No, I ran into the squirrel. I'm not really fond of this Pokemon. I'm just gonna run. No, no, no! I hate these squirrels! I'm not even gonna look at the exclamation mark. I was hoping to find a slit sizzle peed. Sizzle. Sizz. Sizzle. Sizz. Sizzle peed. Yeah, I'm gonna look for sizzle, sizzle pee later. The foxes, foxes, birds, squirrels. I'm looking forward to find a yamp, finding a yamper. I don't really like other things. At least not in this playthrough because um it'll uh ruin it. It's common manners for Pokemon trainers to battle when their eyes meet. And so things send out the squirrel. Go back. Uh, that doesn't really do that much. I gained EXP points, aka experience points. Rickety, level 7. Mm -hmm. Whenever there's a strong trainer, I always look right at them. That's kind of weird. <laughs> oh, is it there anything? A dumb bird. I caught you. Why don't you eat another one? Mm. I was like, oh, I just got out of the corner. I'm not going to avoid her. You and some feather in combination. 
What Pokemon do you have? Cuddle. That is not cute. My Sobble's way cuter. Oh no, that won't be effective. Oh, frick. Oh no, that I knew. I knew it. No red. Um. Ooh. Uh, I'll send out Rickety. Already dealt some damage to them. To the poodle. He's a pound. Mm. He's another pound. But I think we might have an evolution today if I don't get to have a next raid battle. Maybe we'll have an evolution this episode. There's a Pokemon lab. Oh god. I couldn't beat Hop, but I'm gonna beat you. Yeah, I doubt that. It probably has, like, one Pokemon or two at least. Oh. Flip bug. I think that it is going to probably let me. Ooh, you have two. Um. Yeah, guys, that's just me. I don't know. My type advantage is. Fire eats grass, fire beats bug, um, grass beats, yeah, I don't know. Oh, you have a nicket. I have a nicket. A level seven one. He's a water gun. Oh, you have quick attack. Oh, uh, water gun. Ooh, that's the only move you have. Quick attack. Pokemon lose many pain. Okay, let me heal. I have four potions. I think I can heal up 
Gobble. And I can also heal up. Foxy. There's Hop. Look, there's the professor. So you have unraveled all the secrets of the Dynamax phenomenon yet? Oh goodness no, the whole thing is still full of questions. I had hoped that my granddaughter would take over my research, but... Dear me, I'm sorry, I didn't even notice my desk. My name is Magnolia, welcome you trainers. Now come, let's head indoors. Why, hot dear, I see Woo had made some new friends. Can you must do Christmas stuff. I trust you've received the Pokedex from Sonia. I'm sure you'll have to complete it in no time. You must already know about Dynamax and White Prism Star. Professor Magnolia has been doing research into the Dynamax phenomenon for years and years. And it takes pro a proper understanding of the thing if you plan to use Dynamax in for the fullest. There you go again, Leon, always talking about Pokemon. There are other things that are worth knowing about too, you know? Life, like how many different types of tea there are. Hey, Professor, do you do us a favor, would you? Help me convince Lee he should endorse us for the Dim Gym Challenge. Oh, Leon, why wouldn't you endorse them? Pop and Prisma Star only just started out as Pokemon trainers. There is still loads they don't know yet. Dearie, I thought your dream was to have everyone in the Gala region become strong trainers. Isn't that, isn't that right? Well, yeah, you're not wrong. That goal is precisely the reason why I gave them both Pokemon in fact. Right then, in that case, how about this? Let's see if the two of you can show me such a brilliant battle that I am left with no choice but to endorse you. And don't worry, I'll make sure both of your teams are in good shape before the battle starts. And I just healed. Oh, well, well. Right, I'll be waiting outside for the star. Hurried up, Prisma Star. You've got to battle me so I can get myself that endorsement. That's one big battle stage. Oh, this is inside. Blah 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 blah. Mm, let's just have to hop. Something kind of reminds me of how from Sun and Moon. I'm gonna become the greatest Pokemon trainer there is. And to do that, I need that endorsement to take part in the gym challenge. Come at me with everything you have so we can prove to Lee that we've got what it takes. That's I'm rather interested in seeing how you two young trainers battle too. Listen, you two. The reason I'm unbeatable is because I learn from every battle I see or take part in. Part in. That's how I've gotten to where I am today to show me something good in this battle. It's time for my legend to begin. Water gun! Woo, 
was almost it was almost a one hit KO. It rolls, the wheel is rolls. You can make a water gun sauce. This game is so beautiful. It's so fun, in fact. I never want to put it down. Ooh, I don't know if that's a good move or not. Is that the same as kind of Square Bunny? Keep parent Pokemon. Evil War then. Well, look at you, he's really in the tight matchup. Well, no doubt. Can we get four more years against you, huh? Rickety. Nah, I think I'll keep sobbing. It'll be a close one, but that's exactly my sort of match. Eat it, Leon, and the professor watching the battle. Ooh, the one at KO! The one at KO, everybody! Nothing left for my rival. And I even got my Pokeball for perfect two. The screen of defeat and the joy of victory. Yes, going through both is the key to the two of us getting stronger, right? Christmas star. Up. Ah. Well, after seeing a match like that one, I suppose I have little choice but to give you both an endorsement as champion. I obtained a letter of endorsement. I'm gonna pick your butt when, when I get all the gym challenges done. Yes, thanks, Lee. This time I'm going to learn my way through that gym challenge to reach you. You may both be young still and plenty rough around the edges, but it was a proper battle. Sarah and I were both feeling the excitement in every last cell in our bodies. That we were tempted to get caught up in things like how you throw a Pokeball out things that have nothing to do with real strength. Honestly, I've been worried about you still obsessing over that sort of nonsense, but I think you really have grown a bit, little brother. And I'd like to see some more thrilling things in my battle that are used too, Prison Star. Alright, Prison Star, you and me are going to train up against one another to aim for that champion title. Absolutely! The more we keep battling against one another, the more our Pokemon will grow. Huh? What's that? Prison Star, would you look at this? They're wishing stars. Since there are two of them, you should take one yourself.
A stone found in the Gala region with a mysterious power. It's said that your dreams come true if you find one. With one of these, my Pokemon can Dynamax. They're gonna be massive. Yes! Trust you to pull something like this. They say wishing stars fall down for those who have a true wish in their heart, you know? I'll be the greatest trainer ever. I will be the greatest trainer ever. I will be the greatest tra trainer ever. There, I said it three times. So surely my wish will come true now, right? Don't be silly, Hop. Those wishing stars are composed of a curious sort of rock containing unknown power. They are one of the most precious resources we have here in the Galar region. If I won't do a thing for you in that day, give them to me now and I'll have you sorted. Alright, you've done heaps of research on the Dynamax phenomenon, haven't you, Professor? Then please, give Prisma Star and me the power to Dynamax that Pokemon. First, you've got to battle against that mad Pokemon in the Summoning Road, and now it, it's re it really feels like we're getting caught up in the actual adventure of a lifetime. I do understand your excitement, young man. But don't get carried away. You want to save your energy for tomorrow's journey. It seems I came back home right in time for all of the excitement. Hey, you what? Why not have some dinner? You must be hungry, right? I have been totally obsessed with making the latest Candy curries. The cutscene that we this morning at last, and time for our adventure to truly start. Good morning to you, young challengers. Uh, is it true you really met some Pokemon you didn't recognize? Is there anything more you can tell me about it? Er, well, oh, the word heavy fog, and then this even weirder Pokemon appeared. Prism Star tried to fight it off, but I think we both passed out or something. It was all pretty hazy. Alright, found, found, found the information you are. Prism Star Hop, these are for you. Ah, yes! The Dynamax Man! That I can Dynamax! Wishing Star has been, <laughs> been fixed to it. It looks at a light that allows you to want to Dynamax and add a power spot. Those are the Dynamax bands. I made them by fitting the wishing stars we found last night on, into those bands. Thanks, Professor. This is brilliant. Just like the one we have on hand, too. Now that we can Dynamax, Dynamax our Pokemon like he does. My word, you, you don't waste any time, do you? I think you'll find it's mess so simple. Is all that there are a number of conditions you must meet. You hope to have your Pokemon di Dynamax and take on the, that, gigan that gigantic form. Now, don't be afraid to go all sorts of places and meet all sorts of Pokemon. That will help build up your Pokedex, too. The legend of my room is finally about to begin. Come on, Prisma Star. I'll beat you to the station. I'll end this video after I beat the first max raid battle. You must think before we race, is this guy. See, if I've, see if I've got some great advice for you. You know how you sometimes see Pokemon wondering about out of the tall grass, yeah? When you're real slow like and crouch down, those Pokemon won't take you any notice. But on the other hand, she will swap them, they'll be sure to catch their attention. You're a bit rubbish at this one, just remember this. You will have to trick, press the left stick. Right out. 
Let's see who can catch the most Pokemon Pokemon Star. I remember Road Girl Station, right? Where we went to pick up the Eva 4. That'll be our goal. So see you there! No, I ran into Weeper. Weeper, get out of the way. Hop's gonna beat me to the station with that weight. Come on, Pizzle Star. You'll never beat me to the station at that pace. That's right there. Don't really hop on him coming. So, out with it, Pizzle Star. How many did you catch? I was caught a little for something you got not one. What are you doing to catch me? You're gonna want a team if you're a trainer. And I got this. That TM fish. That's a technical machine. A TM, mate. But if I say yeah like that, you can teach your come on me losing a fight. And you can use them. Again and again too. That one can teach the new swift. We gave it to me ages ago. Now it's worse. The gym grounds will begin a motor strike. And I change leaning, so let's go. <sighs> I so not not quite so fast you two. What are you doing here, Mom? I knew this day was coming since the moment, moment you took Spore Bunny as a partner down in Bryce and Magnolia was coming here to her as knowing that you two were setting it out. So here, a last little gift to see you well set on your way. All of the kit you'll need for camping. I got camping gear, a set of camping gear. No matter what happens out there, you and your partner are together. I know you'll be fine. Thanks, son. And just think how lucky you are. Mother, to the first ever pair of champion brothers. Because I'm certain to be the champion next. You'll see. Of course, you will be darling anyway. Do you have any pictures or says? We'll be looking back home anytime. You're off. Okay. Here, that's slow coat. Which is, which is slow. Not that one you did. There are loads of brilliant trainers and all kinds of Pokemon out there waiting for us. My excitement's only ahead of me. Even faster than that train can go, Pizza Star. Come on, we're off. This might be the longest video I've ever had with Pokemon on this little cutscene. Ghosts are surrounded by a vast wild area. It's a real sight. There are all sorts of wild Pokemon just wandering about everywhere you look. Plus, you can camp out and do a spot of fishing, and I don't think I could ever get tired of it. Mr. Station Master, isn't this the wild area? 
Uh-oh, it's not careful. Yes, this is the wild area station. Make no mistake. I'm sorry to tell you that the train is halted due to a fault of ruling on the track. That's what I'm sorry about. This is brilliant. Brilliant? This wild area is massive. There are loads of Pokemon to battle here. You get it, don't you, Pizzy Star? This is the best possible place to put together the greatest team. Okay, but before I do that, talk to this lady over here. Hey, I have some Pikachu head up. Wait, wait, what? Oh no, I can't get the, the chunky chew, no! Run, what? Oh, I don't know what happened, I... Oh, I think I might only get it in one game. <gasps> it is one right there. Why is the Pokemon right there? I might do that one off camera. Yeah, I'll definitely do that one off camera. Hi there, would you like to rescue Pokemon? Yes. I'll take your Pokemon for a few seconds then. I'll do that purple one off camera. And I'll tell you what it is next episode. Look at that. Uh, I'll do that purple one next episode. I mean, off camera. Let's notice start way off that way. In between there and here, there are countless new Pokemon waiting to be met. Oh, ho, ho. Isn't this Sonia? My grand gave me a proper earful in her own ear. Those two young trainers are heading out on a journey. What are you doing so well? I can express. I'm super busy, Amanda. I can play you so good at the forest. I've been quite curious about that Pokemon you two met in the forest. I've been thinking I should look into it so the timing works out fine. If I discover something really huge, then maybe I'll even grand and omit. I don't know, admit it. I've got some talent. Yikes, Dave, an adult has to got, got its own challenges. Eh? I said you didn't need to worry about it. I'm glad to be on the road with you, it's been ages. It'll be great fun to fish and camp and rough it outside again. Well, I'm off to go stick my head in as many of those red glowing gems as I can find. I'm gonna battle the snot out of a bunch of Dynamax Pokemon and fill on another page in the cell of my legend. Let's see. Finding out to put you on a roll on another level, you know. You better dynamite the front of the Pokemon too, if you want to take on a balance that, that strong. You all found spots here and there in the wild area uh, that emit a red beam of light. If you think up to it, Check them out, there'll be Dynamax Pokemon lurking inside. So with that, how about I send you off with a little treat from me? Oh, Pokemon Box Link! Okay, that allows me to... Oh, and that allows me to... Uh, like, let's go Pikachu and Eevee. I know how it works. With the Pokemon Box Link, we'll be able to put Pokemon from your team back into into your boxes or take Pokemon from your boxes to add them to your team. Nice, right? So go old wild, catching as many Pokemon as you like and fill in some more of your Pokedex. That wild area is waiting for you. This is the start of your real adventure. Yeah, I'll do that purple one off camera. And then I'll tell you what Pokemon it was. And, yeah, I'll only do one, then I'll end the video. Ah. I don't know what to 
to him and dropped a cube. The last time when she wandered around in wild area, strong and tried battling one, and it seemed like they're over her head. Try to run, run like the wind. There's one right here. I need a gold pick. Pokemon Den. Blah 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 blah. There's too much dialogue. 300 watts. Uh, okay, I'll do it. Wait, let me change. Let me change my profile real quick. I'll change it to Sable. Okay, it's a bug ground type. I think we could take it. I'll tell you what the purple beam was. That's a mini card. This video is has to be the most longest video I've ever did of Pokemon. And cut off. Dynamax! Sabu Dynamax! Dynamax, Sabu Dynamax! Yes, Giant Sabu! What the, what the flip was that cry? the most damage to the max geyser. Some Clefairy, you don't have probably any good news besides Halloween. Oh no, not the different. Good, 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 good. I will catch it. It's gonna be a big ball. Yes, it's a big ball. Big ball. It's a, like a one or two star. It ain't easy. Nincada. Gotcha, Nincada. Where's my dick? Where's my dino? Nincada's battle will be added to the Pokedex. 
Forget to like and subscribe. Good bye.